What is up, YouTube, man? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Mandra Metal, and we are playing some Dota today. Now, we are playing a bit of Chaos Knights. Um, fun hero, to be honest with you, but, you know, he hasn't been part of the meta for a while, but I've just, I've been trying out a couple of heroes just to see how it's going. And over here, you can see, before we actually continue, we ended up going onto the Abaddon and the the pudge but and our mid laner did tp in um so we are about to just clear up this wave and we end up getting a kill and an assist the laning stage wasn't all too bad it was quite fun uh we managed to you know just keep it keep our farm up and just be active in the lane um, as annoying as the abaddon was with um silencing me uh we did try to get him over here again we are trying to get onto the Abaddon, but the Pudge has hooked him out, so we ended up messing up that. Now, with with Chaos Knight, um, there, are, uh, there are a few builds that you can go, and one of the most popular builds that there is, um, I actually did not use it this game, so, <laughs> or one of the most popular items on this hero, I did not actually go for it this game. Um, looking back at this, it probably was a mistake, because I could have actually, I would have done a lot better with this item. But we'll speak about that later on. Uh, let's focus on this fight. We did have four heroes in this top lane. I ended up going down and it was a little frustrating. That is now our second death. But we are going to go onto this pudge. And now try and claim this tier 1 uh, tower. But before that, we are looking at also claiming the life of this Abaddon. Now Abaddon's ulti has proc. So we are going to try and just kite him out. And there we go. We ended up getting the tier one tower we also claimed a couple of lives of their heroes now after uh treads i did go echo saber echo saber is nice especially with uh, your chaos strike you get that double hit so you get double life steal if you are lucky um and now after that i went blink this is just a nice initiation i thought it could be good for us you know if i can just blink in stun the zeus or stun the uh pudge uh whatever you know or even the marcy because marcy was playing carry um and this game was really back and forth which was quite frustrating because one minute we were doing absolutely amazing next minute we we're getting absolutely wrecked and we are getting team wiped so it was quite frustrating but now we are focusing onto the zeus uh, one thing i should have done there i should have used my ultimate first and then engaged on the zeus and not engage and then use ulti so Again, just need to remember that it is great to actually ulti first and then engage onto the Zeus. And now you can see there the Abaddon, his ulti did go off. And that's what happens with Abaddon is when you start hitting him in his ulti, he just regains all his HP back. And that's not something you want in this game. Uh, or in a team fight, should I say. Because it just means that he can stand for a lot longer. Uh, after Blink, we did end up deciding on the BKB. Uh, this is a good bkb game it just gives us that spell immunity for um in the team fights when we are fighting with that ogre with his stun uh we can with marcy uh abaddon when he does eventually silence you it could e it even helps you with zeus um so yeah bkb great item now the item that i was i did mention earlier that i should have gone and it could have actually worked well um but i ultimately decided against it just because i felt it might not be that useful but again looking back at it it would be it would have been useful it's actually a manta style now a manta style on chaos knight is absolutely amazing but i didn't do it i ended up uh, going against my better judgment and it it wasn't it wasn't terrible it wasn't terrible i still managed to do a lot of things uh, after getting bkb we are going to go for our harpoon now. Again, this is just another engage for us, making sure that uh, we can close the distance between these heroes because they have a lot of heroes that are quite jumpy and they are trying to get away. Like here with this Pudge, we could have harpooned him, bring, brought him closer to us, uh, making sure that we could kill him. So yeah, these, these are little things that you kind of think of during the game and things that you can improve on. And... Item choices in Dota, they really do matter. Um, so over here you can see I was about to get silenced by this Abaddon and I ended up just going out. Marcy comes in 
and we got the kill onto uh, Abaddon, but uh, with all our with our Pangalier falling, I thought you know it's best to let's just get out of here. Um, my support is there, but I thought you know uh, let him let him die. <laughs> yeah, well let him let him sacrifice himself for the for the greater cause. Um, here is a massive team fight now at the moment. Uh, great ulti from the Lich. Now we have claimed the life of the Pudge. Now our focus is onto that Marcy. Marcy is down. This opens up our fight completely because uh, with the Marcy, she has a lot of disable for us and a lot of um, repositioning ability. So um, she can reposition us in the fight, making it a lot harder for us to fight. And we've got a triple kill at the moment and we ended up getting an ultra kill. The Ogre unfortunately has run away because he is scared. And yes, uh, we have claimed the life of the Ogre. Now trying to push this high ground was absolutely frustrating because while running away, I get hooked by the damn Pudge. And it means I ended up losing my life, which is, again, frustrating. But now after getting, um, after getting my BKB, I did go for Silver's Edge. I thought Silver's Edge would not be nice, you know, just positioning yourself in the fights because these guys aren't really going to carry dust around with them so we are just going to use it to reposition ourselves unfortunately we did end up giving our life here and it wasn't the best team fight that we had uh, just like the one earlier where we gave up a full team wipe uh, again this is now not the best and the Huskar was again lackluster the 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 um, the Witch Doctor had some great ulties, but this Huskar was quite lackluster, and um, I don't think had a very good... I don't think the Huskar had the greatest grasp on the game um, and understanding what was going on, so yeah, but it's okay. Now, after BKB, yeah, like I said, we went Silver, Silver's Edge. After Silver's Edge, we are going to go for Heart. We need some tankability. We need to be able to stand in these fights, making sure that we can survive. Um, these team fights and hopefully with that Marcy ulti as well because she absolutely destroyed us in these team fights as you can see here it's just uh, we ended up falling but you know the two supports they had done really well um, they ended up saving the Huskar but yeah t Marcy was my bane in this game now after claiming Aegis uh, we are gonna go on to these guys they did try to stop us from uh, completing Roshan but they weren't able to and we ended up claiming two of their lives now focusing our attention onto this ogre and ogre again surrounded by a couple of boys I've seen that movie this movie before it's not doesn't end well for him so he ended up falling uh, there are a couple of buybacks we are pushing a high ground now because we can um, Marcy is now trying to go onto the supports I think she's realized that the supports are the most valuable uh, in these team fights because of their positioning and where they're standing and it ended up failing she failed quite hard trying to get these supports because we ended up claiming her life but we still have ages of um ages and that is our game we ended up securing the the dub for our team and for um yeah the dub for ourselves which was great i was happy with it but guys you know what it is you let me know what you think of this video Tell me what I can improve on itemization in terms of itemization. What could I have done better and what can I change? But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all the support and we will see you in the next one. Peace out, guys. Cheers. Bye.